Society gets wrapped around becoming a part of a machine. Society, instead of becoming a bunch of individuals that are expressing themselves in unique ways and everybody sort of borrows and shares and, and, and sells this and you sell that and we all sort of figure out how we can contribute in a society, we got sidetracked and diverted into these boxes that they call companies and corporations you've sold your life to sit in a box and work for a machine an uncaring machine that demands productivity it doesn't understand you it doesn't want to understand you everybody's wearing clothes they don't want to wear everybody's showing up and doing something they don't want to do they have no connection to that's the problem with our society. And then what's the reward for all this stuff? Go home, get a big TV. Go home, you're gonna get a shiny belt buckle. You're gonna get a nice purse. You're gonna wear shoes that you couldn't afford last week. You're gonna get that dream car. And every week we're chasing down this new object. And every week we're trying to fill this hole in this, this, this sad shadow of a life that we've been left with after work. That you work eight to whatever to hours a day plus commuting. And then you're like this. And that's your life. That's your real fucking life. All that other stuff is not your life anymore. All that other stuff is work. And most of us have committed to that. I know you've been there before, and I've been there before. And we, we understand that it's a trap because we got out of it. But for the people that are in it, a lot of times they don't even understand it's a trap. They just think it's a good job. They think they got dental. I'm doing really good. You know, I got my own parking spot. It's got my name on it. And you're just a piece of a heartless shitty machine that makes money. We just need to figure out how to restructure society so everybody somehow or another plays a part, has something to contribute, has something to share. I mean, that's what a real society is supposed to be like. In the 17th chapter of St. Luke it is written, the kingdom of God is within man, not one man nor a group of men, but in all men, in you, you the people have the power, the power to create machines, the power to create happiness. You the people have the power to make this life free and beautiful, to make this life a wonderful adventure.